Ryzen 3 is the entry level. Think of it as your starter Pokemon. And not the most powerful, but it gets the job done when you're just starting your journey. It's perfect for browsing, schoolwork, video calls, streaming Netflix, and light gaming. It usually comes with four cores, which means it can handle a few tasks at once, but don't expect it to fight off a dragon. If you're building a budget PC or buying a basic laptop, Ryzen 3 is all you need. It's affordable, reliable, and honestly better than people give it credit for. Funny thing, a lot of people buy Ryzen 3 and then act surprised when it doesn't handle high-end gaming like a beast. That's like buying a bicycle and wondering why it can't keep up with a Ferrari. It's best for students, office workers, casual gamers, or anyone who just wants a computer that doesn't freeze when opening Chrome. Ryzen 5 is where things start to get spicy. It's the middle child, and in this case, the middle child is actually the favorite. It has six cores, sometimes eight, making it great for gaming, multitasking, editing photos, and running more demanding software. If Ryzen 3 is your starter Pokemon, Ryzen 5 is when it evolves, and suddenly you can, you can game at 1080p with no problem, do some video editing, and even stream. It balances price and performance so well that honestly, it's the most popular Ryzen option. Ryzen 5 is like pizza. You don't need to explain it. Everyone just loves it, and it fits almost every situation. It's best for gamers, students who also edit videos, streamers just starting out, or anyone who wants a strong all-rounder without paying too much.